Hey what's going on people, Bearfox here and welcome back to another brand new video. Today I'll show you the best Fortnite FPS guide for season 1 to get better FPS and reduce lag. This video is in collaboration with Tremar so you guys can find the second part of this guide on his channel so check out the link in the description below as well. Also I wanna let you guys know that 98% of you guys haven't yet subscribed to the channel so consider subscribing, I wanna hit 50k as soon as possible and let's roll the intro. Alright, let's move stepwise with this video because this video is going to be really short and simple. First things first is creating a restore point and doing that is really simple. Just press your windows key and type in create a restore point. Then over here scroll down until you find your local disk C which says system over here. Then click on configure and make sure turn on system protection is enabled. Then click on create and then name it Fortnite FPS Boost. Then click on create. This is just a failsafe method to prevent anything going wrong in your PC. Then click on OK. Next step is downloading the FPS pack. I'll be leaving a link to this in the description below. This FPS pack is half by me and half by Tremors. So just download and extract it and then you'll find in two files in here. The first one is for optimization and second one is for programs. Open up the first file and in there you'll find in four registry files. They had their specific reason and function to exist. First one optimizes your game, second one optimizes your GPU, third one optimizes your memory, that is your RAM, and fourth one optimizes your Windows' UI for better gaming experience. All you have to do is right click and merge all of them into your computer. Don't worry, all of these are safe. Next is CMD codes and in here you'll find in these three codes. Just open up your CMD as administrator and then copy all of these codes and paste it in here. Once done, it says the operation completed successfully. Just close your command prompt and close this as well. Then go back to the next folder which says programs in here and you'll find in two programs. First one is empty standby list and second one is MSI mode tool v2. Now open up the first program and it empties your standby list. Next is MSI mode tool v2. Run this program as administrator. Now once it opens up, you need to find your graphic card. Just make sure to click on undefine and then go to high. Then click on apply and close it. That's how you are done with my part of the FPS pack. Alright, step number 3 is disk cleanup and this is also a very simple process. Press your windows key and then type in disk cleanup and then select local disk C and then click on OK. It calculates all of the unnecessary files in here, you can just select all of them. And then click on OK, then click on delete files. Now last but not the least is exit lag and this is one of the most important steps. Exit lag is a free to download software, you guys can click the second link in the description below and then go to free 3 days trial link. Then you can download exit lag's latest version from here. The best part is that exit lag offers you a list of over 250 games to choose from and you can search for Fortnite right away. Once you select your game, just click on these two options and then select the closest region to you. For me, it's gonna be Mumbai 01 and then click on apply routes. As you guys can see, it automatically shows your estimated ping and then Fortnite is optimized. Secondly, exit lag offers you a list of tools you guys can choose from which helps you get better ping and better FPS. For the general settings, enable the second and last two options and all of these options. Then go to FPS boost, enable the first, third, fourth and last two options and then restart your PC. Alright, I wanna let you guys know that exit lag is a free to use application for 3 days and after that you need to buy a subscription. But if this is your first time, you guys can use code BEARFOX20 while checkout for flat 20% off on any of the subscription. So choose wisely. Alright, after restarting your PC, jump into Fortnite and then let's do the in-game settings. Alright, so once you are in-game, all you have to do is go to your settings. 
for window mode, I highly recommend you guys to go for full screen mode. And for resolution, should be your native resolution. And for the frame rate limit, should be unlimited. Then, scroll down for your auto set quality. And then, for the quality preset, make sure to put it to custom. Then, if you have a very low end PC, you guys can take the resolution down to 70%. And for the view distance, I highly recommend you guys to go for medium and everything low and off. For vSync, I highly recommend you guys to turn this thing off and then for show FPS should be turned on. Also, it is highly recommended that you guys should enable allow multi-threaded rendering and rendering mode should be DX11 or performance beta. You guys can use both of these options. Just copy the rest of the settings and then click on apply. Then you need to restart your game. So that was it for today's video guys. I hope you liked it. If you did, make sure to subscribe. And also don't forget to check out Tremor's channel for more information. See you all in the next video. Until then, stay tuned. Keep watching Bear Fox and peace out.